Today, we're in the herd with women's basketball. First year head coach Aaron Russell's team brought him his first win as coach of the Bison Saturday, 59 to 50 over Canisius. I think always the first win of the season, uh, no matter where you're at, no matter what year you are, um, it's sweet. You know, and I think that's something, especially coming off that home opener, I think we were so badly wanted that for the girls to, to experience a win uh, here that, that Wednesday night. So that one hurt, um, but I think that actually probably helped us get that one on Saturday. I think when you run the offense the way that we do it, and it's not a whole lot of us telling people where they have to be all the time, it's going to take some, some growing pains. And I think as a coach, you always forget that, and you always think, oh, it's going to be better this year, it's going to be better this year. This is completely normal. Senior Felicia Mabada says she also has had to adjust some to Coach Russell's offense. I feel like the biggest change is like there's no really set positions whereas like people are guards, people are posts. We have guards and posts but he doesn't really say oh you know you're a guard, you're a post. Our offense is pretty, pretty versatile whereas everyone gets to play different positions. Everyone is basically a post, everyone's a guard. We work on posting up, we work on shooting so we work on everything that has to do with basketball so that's a different change and that's a welcome change and we like that. She feels that getting the win on Saturday was very important especially the way the team did it. We were up by halftime and our like, thought going into it was first four minutes and that's our thought going to like all the games we played so far so first four minutes we have to come out with a bang and like don't fall behind keep that lead and keep going and even when we have those slumps to like keep it up so like keep our emotion up um, and that would just keep everything up and that's what happened. Bucknell is back in action again Wednesday night at 7 when they host the Niagara Purple Eagles.